We are also officially hours away from Election Day. And officials are hopeful that voters will still come out to the polls regardless of the weather tomorrow. Two News reporter Caroline Morse is live with us in the studio right here on your local election headquarters. Caroline. That's right. Ohio Secretary of State Frank LaRose says early voting turnout was down at the start of the election cycle, but they've seen an increase as the weeks have passed. In many ways, the primary sets the tone and the direction for both parties, and so it's important that, that voters get out there and make their voice heard in this election. Voters are officially hours away from the polls opening, marking the beginning of primary voting. Ohio Secretary of State Frank LaRose has been traveling around to all Board of Elections preparing workers for the May primaries. However, state reps, state Senate, and state Central Committee ballots will not be on the ballot this year for Ohioans due to redrawing redistricting maps. The Rose says the second voting primary will most likely be August 2nd. And it's unfortunate that we ended up having to have a split primary like this, but there's a, a primary tomorrow on May 3rd, and then there'll be a second one later in the summer. It's not 100% sure yet, but it will most likely occur on August 2nd. That date will event eventually be set by either the state legislature or the federal court. Montgomery County Board of Elections says they are fully staffed for the May primaries, but will never turn down extra help. Yes, we have everything staffed uh, at this point. Uh, we know we've got a little extra staff, so we'll juggle some. If someone were to get sick tonight or something like that, can't make an appearance tomorrow, we've got that covered. The Rose estimates in 2020, Ohio had 56,000 poll workers ready. However, this year that number was nearly cut in half at an estimated 30,000 poll workers across the state. Overall, over 4,000 polling locations are ready to serve Ohioans. Invariably going to be people that have their conspiracy theories and, and, and that kind of thing. The bottom line is in Ohio, we make it easy to vote and hard to cheat. Now, polls will be opening at 6.30 tomorrow morning and will stay open until 7.30 tomorrow evening. Live in studio, Caroline Morse, 2 News working for you.